after dark hours tonight, the most high issue with you is that the most high know you have a guilty conscience. But you was accusing Divine Feminine of cheating, hiding secrets due to, to do, but it was due to your own guilty conscience. So that was the most high issue with you and Daddy's girl. Spoiled brat, close connection to father, used to being taken care of financially, expects you to play dad. So I don't know if the most high issue with you, Divine Masculine, is that you had a guilty conscience but was blaming Divine Feminine the whole time. In the past, you had a guilty conscience but was blaming her. You was five swords in the past. So you was trying to defeat Divine Feminine at all costs. But it's not because Divine Feminine did something wrong. Divine Masculine, you had a guilty conscience. The Most High didn't like that. And something about a daddy's girl. I don't know, Divine Master. Maybe the karmic is a daddy's girl. So it's like... Spoiled brat. It's like you was... um cowering down to the karmic. But I'm getting Divine Masculine. It wasn't so much the fact that you probably liked it, the karmic over Divine Feminine. It was just the fact that your, the karmic stroked your ego. So it's like you could have spoiled the karmic. Yeah, the karmic could have been acting like a daddy's girl. Or she was a daddy's girl. But that's the most high issue with you, Divine Masculine. <clears throat> or it could be the fact that, um, because it say expects you to play dad. So, I don't know if the most high issue with you is that the most high could be saying to you, Divine Masculine, you know how you lived your life. Don't be calling on me now because, you know, you in trouble. Don't expect me to play your Heavenly Father when I wasn't your Heavenly Father when you was mistreating Divine Feminine. Something like that, the, the most high could be trying to tell you too. Because the card say expects you to play dad. So it's like the most high issue with you is that you now all of a sudden you expect him to play to play dad to you. Or you expected the most high to I don't know. You could have been expecting something from the most high. <clears throat> I don't know if you expected the most high to sit back and allow you to mistreat divine feminine. Because that was that's something probably your earthly father will allow. But the Most High is not going to allow you, him being the Heavenly Father, he's not going to allow you to mistreat Divine Feminine and you were wrong. You had a guilty conscience. Yeah. I think the Most High issue with you at the dark hours tonight, Divine Masculine, the Most High knew you had a guilty conscience. You was accusing Divine Feminine, wanted to cause, cause her some type of defeat. And you chose a daddy's girl over Divine Feminine. That's what I'm picking that up. This karmic was a spoiled brat. But you treated Divine Feminine like she was a spoiled brat. Like you was teaching Divine Feminine a lesson. <clears throat> and that wasn't, that was, that was wrong. That was an injustice, yeah. And you chose Divine Feminine over a, a spoiled brat. Yeah, the karmic is a spoiled brat. Yup. Mm-hmm. So, it's like the most high is like disappointed in you, Divine Masculine. Because it's like, that's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Like, how can you not notice his child, but you would choose a spoiled brat over Divine Feminine? That's embarrassing <coughs> to the most high. I mean, he understand. <coughs> but it's like Divine Masculine. You're still a Divine Masculine, but it's like... The Most High still kind of got your back, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, but you're being rebuked. Because it's like, he's ashamed of you. He's ashamed. So it's like, I believe Divine Masculine, after dark hours, you're probably now awakened. Or you're, after dark hours tonight, you're in the process of the beginning stages of awakening. Yeah. So the Most High is doing you a favor. You're awakening. But I, he, I don't think he's, I, I just feel as though he's disappointed. I'm getting the most highest disappointing in you, Divine Master. I don't know what you did, what you was thinking, what that karmic did. But the most high is like protecting Divine Feminine to like the fifth degree. Because it's like shameful. It's like he protecting Divine Feminine for his, for his namesake. Because Divine Master, it's like you ought to be ashamed of yourself. 
Like, mm mm. The, the most high ain't even. Mm mm. The divine feminine right now is like off limits. She's off limits. <clears throat> yeah, divine masculine, you messed up royally. But it's all for the it's all for the good though. It's for the good. Yeah, it's for the good. I don't think the most high completely has turned his back on you. I just think he I think what the most high is doing is healing divine feminine. He's working on divine feminine. He's protecting divine feminine. But what just came to me is the divine masculine, the most high is making you feel Whatever you did to the two divine feminine, that's what the most high is doing to you. Yeah, because his daddy's girl came out here. So I don't know. The most high could be telling you divine masculine, divine feminine is my girl. Like she's, divine feminine could have been a daddy's girl. Unbeknownst to you, divine masculine. Something like that. Yeah, I think the, the most high is making you feel whatever you did to divine feminine, this deception, this pettiness, this five of swords. He's allowing you here. Yeah, you getting karma? Yeah. Yep. That's what's going on. So, like I said, divine masculine. After that, I was tonight. What the Most High is doing to you is like say, like you go knock on divine feminine door and you ask to speak to, to divine feminine. The Most High is not going to allow divine feminine to come to the door. The Most High is going to come to the door. Or Divine Feminine's Father is going to come to the door. You are not allowed to speak or see your Divine Feminine. That's all I'm picking up. And that's literally <clears throat> or energetically. So I don't know Divine Masculine. On the 3D, Divine Feminine could have a restraining order against you. I don't know. But it's like you're not allowed to see her or speak, of, or speak to her. So this could be the Most High doing this. Or this is like some restraining order, like on the 3D, something like that. But either way, Divine Masculine, <clears throat> you're being restricted from Divine Feminine. Whether the Most High is doing it himself or Divine Feminine that went on a 3D and got a restraining order against you. Or blocked you on some of her devices. Yeah, because you under judgment. You under judgment. So it's like you can't come in Divine Feminine energy. It's like you're not allowed in her energy. And she's not allowed to be detected. Yeah. So I'm going to end it at that. I'm going to leave that. I'm going to leave it. But Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine wants you. But I think the Most High told Divine Feminine, you can want him all you want, but not right now. Probably never. Yeah. So right now, it ain't about what Divine Feminine wants. That's all I'm getting. Because the Most High is in charge of this. It ain't about what Divine Feminine wants. Yeah. <laughs> so Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine, please keep in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with you. Some parts of this reading... Might resonate, other parts might not. Please keep in mind that energy and timing is fluid. So this reading can manifest after dark hours tonight. It can manifest later on down the line of time. Or this could have been something that happened in the past. So again, this is Blood Queen Tarot. Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and or share. Um, and good night.